Okay, we're here with the lightweight Manx Grand Prix winner from 2011, Dave Moffat. Dave, can you tell us about your preparations for TT 2012? Um, I've been racing um, primarily up at uh, Jerby um, with Andrews Racing Association. Um, I've had several wins on the uh, Super Twin machine, which is uh, the predecessor to the machine that I'll be racing in the TT this year. Um, we've tested this machine at uh, Castlecombe a couple of weeks ago. Uh, in wet conditions and it was uh, very 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 good bodes well for the CST. yeah the uh, Suzuki's uh, 650 super twin uh, machine which has been built by uh, James Holland of JHS Racing and um, he's put in five six months of real hard work to, to get it to the condition that it's, that it's in now um, it should be should be a forerunner uh, in the in the actual main main races uh, the, the Triumph bike um, that has been developed over three years. Um, Aaron Walker has been riding it in uh, both BSB and late, more lately of uh, Thundersport. He had a third position at Donington Park uh, three weeks ago on it. Um, so he's got really good pedigree. Um, both both bikes prepared by James at JHS Racing. Yeah. Um, obviously we've got um, JHS Racing, um, who are the, the, the main sponsors. Um, we've got ARH, ARH Group, um, who, are, who have helped out. Um, Patricia Wild Opticians on, on the Isle of Man. Um, Dry Lease Aero who have helped out and there's uh, some other uh, personal sponsors as well. We've also had support from RST Leathers and RI Helmets. Um, primarily is to have uh, three really good strong finishes. Um, I'd, I'd like to finish in the top six on the Super Twin and in the top 12 on the Super Sport. At lap times I'd like to think around 115, 116, maybe pushing 117 on the uh, Super Twin and over 120 on the Super Sport.